on Pisces and Cross Watchers. This is Mystic Intuition bringing you your monthly reading for November 16th through the 30th of 2019. Keep in mind that however time this went, and whenever you do, this is when you're meant to hear the message. If it, however, does not resonate for you, you can try checking your moon rising and Venus signs for love. What messages, spirit, do you have for Pisces for the last half of November? What messages and guidance can we give our Pisces? Trust and surrender. We are using the Dreamers Tarot, uh, Mystic Dreamer Tarot, and the Vintage Wisdom Oracle. I'll put the decks in the description box as well. You can now find my upload schedule in the description box, as well as the About Me section of my YouTube channel. We have the Seven of Wands, the Two of Wands, the Seven of Swords, the Moon, and the Nine of Cups. At the bottom of the deck, we have the Emperor here. So Pisces, I feel like you're in an energy here where you're really having to trust your intuition about something. There's been something you've been kind of holding yourself back from. You've been in this emperor mode where you've been holding yourself back from a situation. Um, this is you really saying it in your own power. The emperor, whether you're male or female, is the embodiment of all the kings. You know, he's brave, he's courageous, he's passionate, he's stable, he's secure, he's kind, he's compassionate. He's everything rolled into one. Okay? Um, this is also divine masculine energy here. So, um, whether this is you or your person... This is somebody really standing in their power. They're really holding themselves back. Um, there's been some secrets here that have yet been revealed with this Pisces moon here. There's been some secrets that haven't been revealed. There's some mystery about the situation. You're trying to trust your intuition. There's someone coming in here, this Knight of Cups. This could be you. This could be your person. There's this energy here, Cancer Scorpio Pisces energy of someone really... Um, coming in with a sincere offer here this could be an apology for some of you this could be an offer of love this could be um, asking someone on a date this could be so many different things for some of you um this is somebody kind of coming in here they're really having to fight their feelings but they're they're beginning to surrender to this connection that they feel they're trusting the process they're trusting that these secrets will be revealed within time with the Seven of Wands, I feel like there's been some conflict here that's like this defensiveness here that's like ready to defend your heart at any given time um, regarding this individual. With the Two of Wands, you feel like there's a choice to be made here. There's two paths you can take here. Um, the Seven of Swords, you feel like someone's getting away with something. Um, this could be you trying to get away with something, trying to hide a secret, or this could be your person. And you feel like they're they're hiding a secret from you. They're trying to get trying to get one over on you, right? What additional messages and clarity do we have for our Pisces spirit? What additional messages do we have? What guidance can you give us for the last half of November 2019? The Four of Wands and the Star. Yeah. Again, on the bottom of the deck. The Emperor, like I said, you're standing in your power, Pisces. You're really seeing your worth. You're seeing your value. You're seeing what you bring to the table. You're not going to settle for anything less than what you deserve. But the situation you're trusting yourself about is a connection that you feel. You feel like this person, because we have the star here and the four of wands, I feel like for some of you this is a twin flame connection or a deep spiritual connection. But you feel this connection with someone. This is moving to a higher level of commitment. You're feeling this connection with someone that is your wish fulfillment, that is this this healing energy for you. You're, tr you're trying to fight it, but you're surrendering to the possibility that this is your twin flame or your divine counterpart. Um, however it resonates for you, not everyone resonates with that term. But you're, you know there's mystery, there's secrets regarding this. You're feeling very defensive. You feel like this person's getting, getting something 
over on you or, or vice versa. It can apply to cross watcher. Just take it how it resonates in your situation. But someone here has been fighting their feelings about a situation, but now they're coming to the realization that this is their wish fulfillment. This is what they need. They're making, they're surrendering to making this offer of love. I feel like they're making this offer to you, Pisces. Uh, there's been secrets here regarding this connection, um, but you're trusting the process. And with the emperor here, I feel like you're really standing in your power. You're not taking less than you deserve. Yep. Under the emperor here, we have the high priestess, more Pisces energy. This is you really standing, you know, in your power, trusting your intuition here with the high priestess. There's secrets, there's mysteries here, but you intuitively know. You intuitively know and you feel like this is your divine counterpart i really feel like for a lot of you that are watching you know this is either like a really deep soulmate connection a past life type of connection or this is someone who for some of you this will not resonate with everyone that is your twin flame and you're trusting your intuition in regard to this individual regarding this new beginning with them yep under here we have cancer energy with the chariot here this is fast forward movement in a direction you really sense that this is your person you really can't fight these feelings any longer with the Seven of Pentacles, you've been waiting for this to come together for quite some time, Pisces. You've been waiting for what feels like an eternity for your crops to grow, for your ships to come in, to be able to make these changes, to make this offer of love. Yep. <laughs> and they're there. Will of Fortune. This is going to have to be a bonus reading because I feel like it's not going to resonate for everyone. Will of Fortune. This is all happening within divine timing. You're standing in your power now. You're seeing your worth. There's mystery involving this connection. There's some secrets that haven't quite been revealed. There's, And I feel like for some of you, these secrets are the fact that someone's been holding back their feelings, but they're surrendering to that connection now. These secrets are how that person feels. You're really not, there's no light being shed on what this person feels, but you're trusting your intuition about this, about the spiritual connection the two of you have. You intuitively know the significance that you each have to each other. And I feel like all within divine timing, you know, you're going to charge forward. You're going to use your intuition. You've been waiting for a while, but within timing, things will come together. Things will come together for the two of you. All right, Pisces. So I feel like that was a good reading, but I feel like this will have to be a bonus because it's very, um, specific and i feel like it's only going to resonate for a handful of you so if this was your message please like comment and subscribe and i thank you so very much for watching now bye bye